What is up guys? In today's episode, we have yet again another mail call video. Uh, this is from Dane Self. We were talking on Instagram and he wanted to send me these forecasts. So I can't wait to open this up because I needed these in my collection. It's a really big box, but it should only be the forecast that me and him were kind of talking about. Um, and he wanted to send it to me. So thank you again, Dane, for sending me this. But before we get to that, um, I wanted to give a huge thanks and love to King Nut. He, uh, we met up with each other yesterday. He picked up this really clean cherry coke hauler set of the 1990 fox body gt in white look at this guy that is really clean um, and then of course you have the 1965 ford econoline van sitting up front he actually texted me asking if i had this and surprisingly i did not um, the only one i've ever seen lately is this one uh, which I picked up not that long ago, but this is an 88 Fox body and this is finally into the 90s So this is a 1990 GT all my other ones I have like over here for m2 lift series are 88s like all these are 88s except for this one. This is an 87 um, So that's another 88. So finally got myself a 1990s Fox body. King Nut, thank you so much for that. Of course, I'm just going to sit this right here, but I definitely got to do something different with this area. Um, my haulers are starting to build up, and then of course, it's hiding a lot of my IDs that I have back here. I got to figure out what I'm going to do with all of this, but it doesn't stop here, guys. He also hooked me up with a new variation of a 67 GT500. Check this out, guys. This color is nice. It's almost like a washed out olive green with the darker green contrasted stripes right there. Check that out, guys. That thing is nice. Look at the detail. Of course, you do have the, the black wheels that you can go with or the gold, which I think if I set this up, I would probably do the gold. Um, and then you have the choice of the red velocity stacks or like a top fuel type blower um, in black. So that looks really, really cool. Um, I think the only other 67 Shelby I have is actually not one i have a 68 convertible that he also hooked me up with um i got the 67s that dotson man hooked me up with which is freaking beautiful and then i think that is it i got a 68 here 68 yeah so first 67 gt500 so definitely not opening up this one he wanted me to but i cannot open this especially since it's the first year um, in a lift series for ground pounders that i have in my collections i actually forgot to mention this i picked this up maybe two weeks ago at walmart uh, it's a 66 ford mustang gaster with the fanta livery on there definitely do like it i love the white and pink and you got the pink tinted glass very signature to gassers um, but look at that very very nice love the love the m2s man these things are just really really nice i still think johnny lightnings are my favorite um side brand collections of cars so i mean you can't go wrong with johnny lightnings m2s even auto worlds these are all my favorites so i'm gonna go ahead and put this back up here because this is where it's been sitting for two weeks now um but again thank you king nut for hooking me up with these these are freaking amazing now i gotta figure out where i'm gonna put the 67 because um, I don't have any more room down at the bottom. So I might have to move some G machines. I have a couple stacked over there on top of each other of the G machines. So I might just do that as well. We're going to go ahead and get to the package. Let's open this bad boy up and see what we got. I believe there's Zamax, if I remember. I think we'll open up this side. All right, guys, let's get this bad boy open. Oh, nice. Shoebox. That's actually pretty smart. We have a lot of shoeboxes because my wife has a lot of shoes. Um, never thought about using those. I don't know why. All right, let's see what we got in here. It's actually well packaged. Okay, it's just a sticker, it looks like. All right, guys, you ready? Okay, this is definitely more than the four cars I thought he was sending me. Oh man, look at this guys. Woo, we got the Zamax. Yep, a box of Zamax guys. Oh yeah. Here we go. We got the new 2021 Ford GT40. Yes. Any of the first waves have not even hit my area. Normally we do get a good amount of Zamax 
um, when they drop. But here we go, guys. Look at this. This looks really good as a Zamac. You got the red and white stripes with the number four meatball on the side with the black MC5s. And this is number four out of the second wave. And then you got right here number five, Subaru WRX STI. Look at this. This is a really nice color setup. You got the black STI deco with the blue chrome stripe right there. And of course it ties into the blue chrome Y5s. Look at that guys. Oh, that is sweet. Here we go. The Zamac Cyclone number six. This is the one I was really wanting as well. Actually, all of the Zamax were on my list. They just never got here. You have the really nice tampos right there on the back and then the Zamac badge right there on the rear as well. Of course, you still have the RA6 wheels in tribute of Ryu Asada. Um, this thing is freaking sweet. So finally got the second wave. I have the first wave and the second. So this is awesome. And then of course you see right here guys, he hooked it up again. You got the 70 Buick GSX, which is a beautiful casting. You got the flames right there. The red PR5 with the blue tinted glass. Very, very nice. Of course you got the 71 Dodge Demon. Look at that. This is nice. You got the orange flames with the purple outlined pinstriping and the gold PR5s with the pink tinted glass. Definitely a sweet one. You got the 68 Olds 442 looking really good with these yellow and orange flames, the green tinted glass and the black sealies which are my favorite wheels for castings like this. Look at that. Last but not least you got the 68 Barracuda, the Formula S with I think these are really cool flames I love the way they run on the hood and over the fenders like that you have the black PR5s with the white ring and the yellow tinted glass and look at that guys hopefully I can continue this full series for 2021 it looks like these are out of F case um, so yeah we've already started hitting G case which still haven't been in our area but we've seen that trickle in um, and we haven't seen any of these we saw a lot of last year's um, wave of Zamax hit again so I don't know why we're not getting anything new for 2021 again Dane thank you so much for sending me those and King Nut thanks so much for hooking me up with the 90s Fox body as well as this beautiful 67 GT500 but yeah guys I think we're starting to reach the point where I'm falling behind again on packages so if you're still waiting on something from me please be patient just know I haven't forgot about anybody I will send out your stuff um, yeah that's just the thing about doing trades and mail calls and all that is just you fall behind super super quick of course you guys know if you need anything let me know in the comments I'll try to hunt my best for you of course I can't hunt for everybody because that kind of takes the the focus off the stuff I'm hunting for but of course just let me know I'll keep an eye out um, and I usually write stuff down like that of who needs what um, and all that so that is all I got guys really wanted to share this unboxing with you like I always like to share with you hopefully you enjoyed the video if you did give it a huge thumbs up it's greatly appreciated let me know which one of these Zamax was your favorite or if you like them all and until next time guys this is the Mustang Hunter Peace.